Wednesday, Brent fam. I know what you're thinking. Whoa, this is Cam. That's not Darren. I know, crazy, crazy. So, as you may or may not know, hopefully you do. We're pretty open about it. If not, this is going to come as a huge shock to you. We are two weeks behind on the vlog. So, what you're seeing today, um, vlog 316, was recorded on the 19th of August. But, it is being released today. September 2nd. Now, September 2nd happens to be my birthday. I'm 25 today. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Oh, birthday wishes. You're too kind. Thank you. Uh, but yeah, it's my birthday. I'm, I'm pretty excited about it. I'm turning 25. And you know what they say in SpongeBob? I thought of something funnier than 24. 25. Hello, Print Fan. It is almost 7 p.m. and I am just kind of barely getting to work today. I've been out here for about 20, 30 minutes, but I went swimming with the family for a good chunk of the day. I did come out first thing this morning, record a podcast with Derek. Links to our podcast down in the description. Um, but then I went swimming, and as you might be able to see, I'm kind of sunburned. I always forget to kind of get up in my, I always call these my bald spots because I I look pretty bald if I go like this. <laughs> All I have to do is cover. <laughs> anyway, just barely getting to work. Done a couple of admin things. It was super nice to come to my email and see that a bunch of people paid while I was swimming. Um, so it makes me happy getting Bob's commission up, so hopefully he doesn't have to find a job. So working on getting that built up for him and trying to get my stuff wrapped up. I was just going through kind of the jobs in Monday and we've got one print job that's ready. So it's due tomorrow. So I'm gonna maybe avoid it until tomorrow to see if I could get another job so I don't have to turn the printer on. I should have printed it last night while I was doing the curriculum, but I didn't think about it. Um, it is a book of some kind, and I think it's like 200 pages, so it shouldn't be terrible. I just don't want to have to turn the printer on to do that one thing. Um, let's see what else we got. We're doing some promotional stuff. All the promotional stuff is outsourced, so we've got some USB sticks and some pens. The USB sticks are through KTI promos, and the pens are through Gold Star. Uh, screen printing, we've got one active job there, um, and it was actually delayed, unfortunately, because of a hiccup with shirts. And we've got quite a few heat transfer jobs. Speaking of which, I gotta order some shirts. So uh, we're doing some shirts, some masks, another shirt, apparently another shirt, something for Bob that, I don't know, and another shirt. So apparently all day he's gotten a bunch of little shirt orders. Uh, he did call me, we've got an order in SS, and he said, please place it and add whatever you need to order. And I know somewhere I need to, oh, there's some shirts. That's what I need. So, got some shirts we got to order from SS. And then in large format, we've got some backlit film that was due today, apparently. So, I should get that on the printer. We've got the Bonneville replacement. Bob screwed up. Bod, Bob just added. What, well, he's, he's adding one right now. It just showed up which is horrible because this was one that we shipped off to Arizona. Um, so apparently a reprint is what he's saying for this one. Um, so we've got some vinyl, a banner, some stickers, and then this reprint, which he just said is due Monday. And then I've got an outsourced banner that I still need to design. So the reason I'm outsourcing that specific banner is it is two feet wide, 12 feet long, double-sided. and one, I try not to do over eight feet, and two, I can't do double-sided. I could theoretically print it 24 feet, fold it in half, but I'm not gonna do it. So, my name's Darren, 
welcome back to the print shop. I'll find something fun for us to do today. So I was talking to Derek, Alvalu Designs, and most of his business is online. So I know there's gotta be a way. And Lambooty, I'm gonna take you up on your offer to help me. Um, but I've been working on businesscardsonly.com because I feel like that's one way that I could do better. The website was crappy, so I tweaked it a little bit. I took off a bunch of the products, and I'll maybe slowly add more products to it, but right now I'm focusing on just basic business cards. So, I, you go, let me just show you. All right, so here's what I got so far. Really crappy logo. <laughs> Um, it's just a placeholder. It's not important. So my thought on this was get rid of all the other products. So get rid of the business card stickers, the business card magnets, plastic, thick, painted edge, all that stuff. Let's just start with a very simple product. My thought was give them three options. They can design it online. So they can come here, design online. They click it, click the quantity, click the finish. Click personalize and it's going to take them to this beautiful simple online designer where they can add text images shapes different clip art which i don't have any clip art i probably should get some in the library they can generate a qr code they can generate a map all these different things they can save it which then it'll create an account they can add it directly to the cart they can go to the back side the template is designed for my Konica. It's got the little red dot so that it is the bleed line so that people know and understand it. So it's perfect for the Konica to print. I get print ready files from it. it makes it super easy. Next option, I thought, let them upload. So they already have a design. Select the quantity, select the finish, upload the file, add to cart, check out. Third option, use our designer quantity finish and then two types where they want simple text and logo and then a full design so it'll change the price based off of what they want so i feel like it definitely needs some more but i think it's a good starting place and i definitely am gonna start pushing it online to see if i can get some more hits to it I've had this website for almost a year and not a single order. That's okay. I haven't worked on it very hard or tried very hard. I am going to go find a clip of the Konica printing and maybe add a little video clip on here and make it look a little nicer. Um, but yeah, if you have any feedback, please let me know. Um, I use Divi from Elegant Themes to do all my web design because I find it's really easy, really simple. I'll leave a link to it down below, as well as I'll leave a link to a video I made on my tech channel a few years ago, which it still works, um, that walks you through how I run websites. Um, super easy, super affordable. You can do it for as little as five bucks with an SSL certificate. So don't pay GoDaddy. You're wasting your money if you're paying GoDaddy. Switch to, I use ServerPilot and DigitalOcean combined. Um, you can do it for as little as five bucks with just digital, digital oceans with server pilot and digital oceans You're about 15, but SSL multiple websites highly recommend super easy. So that's Kind of businesscardsonly.com. Let me know what you think. I'd love to know your feedback.
just finished printing some vinyl and this job was sent twice but I forgot to make a new job and I had apparently just deleted the queue and so this job was sent twice even though I didn't need it stupid Darren why on to the cut Stickers are done, making a late night post office run. Got some pens for Bob. And I'm not sure what else we gotta do. So let's get back home. It's time to call it print fam. Got back from the post office, did a few more administrative things. Got some YouTube videos ready to go, but Gmail is having some sort of outage tonight. So can't be sending emails, so it's kind of, tied my hands. We're going to finish up the vinyl that I cut for Bob tomorrow, and then hopefully tomorrow we have got approval for uh, the couple of print jobs that he has in there. I am going to finally print some little cards so that I can send the, the stickers that I promised I was gonna send two weeks ago. Sorry. I didn't send them. My bad. It was just a really crappy week and it just got worse and worse and worse. So hopefully this week will be better. The family's gonna be gone tomorrow, so it'll give me time to get it done. I'm gonna type it in Monday so I don't forget it. Please provide me some feedback on businesscardsonly.com. Um, trying to jump into e-commerce and build that up so that I don't necessarily have to hunt and kill everything. Maybe it'll be more like dynamite in a pond. I don't know. I can't think of a good analogy. It's two o'clock in the morning. So happy two o'clock club. Thank you for being here. If you have any... Let's try that again. If you have any questions about what I do, why I do it, how I do it, etc., leave those questions 
down in the comments. Thank you, Cam, for editing the videos. Really appreciate you. Cam is so good that he was gonna be gone this Saturday, so he pre-edited videos so that the print man could have them. So thank you, Cam. I hope you enjoy your boating trip. It is a boating trip, right? So, I went to Flaming Gorge. And we did boat one day on a pontoon boat. Um, it was a good time. It was a really good time. Uh, I broke my butt. I was carrying a blind dog down like a hill because he couldn't navigate it himself. There was like a couple foot drops. He had to like jump down every now and then. He couldn't navigate it himself because he was blind. So I was carrying him. And as I'm carrying him down the hill, I just boom. I fell and uh, it hurts to sit, it hurts to stand, existence is pain, I have a little donut to sit on that my cousin ah, was kind enough to get for me, kind of. He works at Walgreens and he's the manager so got me a sweet discount. But. I also twisted my ankle when I fell, and I think it's broken. Otherwise, I had a really good trip. Thank you. Thank you for being here. If you guys want to support the channel, you can do so with the links down in the description. I greatly appreciate you using the Amazon affiliate, all of you on Patreon, and all of you that just watch, like, subscribe, and share. It really does mean a lot to me. It is fun making these videos most of the time other than last Friday when I got frustrated with life. It's fun making them. I appreciate the feedback and I need to just buy AC. It's miserable in here. It is serious. It's two o'clock in the morning and it's 80 degrees in my shop. It's colder outside. There's something wrong. Thank you for being here. Thank you for the suggestions. We'll see you in tomorrow's one. Huge shout out to our patrons over at patreon.com forward slash TTMS.